The overall goal of this procedure is to grow an anodic electroactive microbial biofilm from wastewater inoculate and to characterize its bioelectrocatalytic properties. This is accomplished by first setting up, inoculating, and starting a potentiostatically controlled bioelectrochemical fed batch reactor. The second step is to monitor the current production using chronoamperometry. Next, the medium is exchanged regularly after substrate exhaustion until a reproducible maximum current density is reached, representing a steady state biofilm formation. The final step is to study the extracellular electron transfer of electroactive bacteria using cyclic voltammetry during the presence and absence of the substrate. Ultimately, data analysis provides fundamental insights into the microbial electron transfer thermodynamics and allows the formal potential of possible and actual extracellular electron transfer sites to be determined. The main advantage of this technique is that one can obtain direct insight into the electron transfer between microorganisms and solid electrodes, and thus derive fundamental information on the microbial extracellular electron transfer. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle with the right parameter choice and the correct interpretation of the derived plot. During data acquisition and data analysis, severe mistakes can be made.